Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome to another Destiny 6 guide video. And today we're going to be tackling level 8 Feral Titan. I barely just hit it yesterday. I was able to clear it yesterday as well, but I did not get the 3-star three, three Conqueror achievement. So unfortunately, it's not going to be that easy, especially with 4-star team. So what I'm going to do is show you a little trick. In this game, you can actually use your friends for help. So I'm going to phone a friend today, and I'm going to be using my friend's Rock Jun. Uh, not that one. Where is Endemic? There he is. He's going to be helping me today. I'm going to set him on the team right there. So what we're going to do is we're going to try to get that achievement. Let me, let me go back to what, what it was talking about. So right here... So this first clear achievement, what I did is all I did was revive. So what I get, what I did the first time was I got him to like really low HP, and then I let him kill me, and I revived, and I killed him right away to get 100% HP. Because it's extremely difficult. So the thing is that if you're struggling to do like your daily dungeons and stuff like that, it's absolutely okay to achieve one star at a time. And it's absolutely okay as well to use a friend and or you know just reviving and because what you need at the end of it is the three star conqueror status right once you get that three star conqueror status it goes from like very difficult to a lot easier so anyways without further ado we're just gonna go straight into it um, there's not gonna be too much into it other than the fact that I need to use I need to make sure I have strike available immediately because we only have three minutes to clear it so at the beginning there's like a bunch of like little mini oh little mini like trash units that so would sometimes take a lot of your time so it's best to get through it as quick as you can okay and it's absolutely okay to revive to die and revive but you want to make sure you keep track of your time and you're doing it in a orderly manner you know what i mean i'm gonna try to get rid of these as soon as i can my auto is off so i always forget to turn that off but it is already off already I'm just gonna wait for everyone to come here bam okay i'm gonna try to group them right here wait for them to do that first body slam whack 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 and whack. So we're gonna use Jun here. Bam. Say so we just got rid of that guy really quick. Really quick. Okay. So we're just gonna probably die here and let let because we want to do it as quick as we can, right? Like I said, this is gonna be an investment at, up front. I'm just telling you this now. This is gonna be an investment. Mainly because you have to get the three star conqueror status in order to make this a little bit less difficult. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna try to do it the best as we can and be like crucial with our time. Just making sure we're doing everything that we can. We're gonna go in here, we're gonna hit this guy, bang, bang, bang. We're gonna try to charge up our Jun as well. So, right here. It's gonna be a big one there. Bang, bang, bang. We really don't want to use our AoEs right here because uh, I'm just gonna use it very quick. Alright, we got Jun almost coming up here. We have all three of our breaks as well. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna have to initiate this boss where he activates his skill right away. So, we're just gonna run around, make sure he's ready. We got our strike ready. Okay, we're gonna dodge this and we're gonna do a break. Break and break. And then we're gonna use our Jun right here. Bang. Do as much damage as we can. Keep hitting him as much as we can. Bang, bang, bang. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and die here. Because we want to revive. So we're gonna go ahead and die. Okay, perfect. So by the time this thing goes up. And he didn't give us a break, which is kind of weird. Oh my god, that was a mistake. Mistakes were made, mistakes were made. Come on, let, let me break. Oh god. This is such a waste, I think. Hopefully I got it. I don't know. 
Oh boy, it's pretty close. Come on, babies. Let's go to move that to the right here. Come on. We're almost there, so close. Oh boy, oh boy. I don't know if we've got it there. It was kind of, I, I made so many mistakes there. Hopefully you guys do a better job at it, but that's what I mean. Like, all I did was just revive. I invested about like, I don't know, under 200 rubies just to get that three-star conqueror status. Now I have the conqueror status. So yeah, there was a few mistakes there, right? When I died and I, and I revived, I didn't, I didn't have, what you call it? Um, the break ability so I was just spamming skills and I wasn't doing a lot of damage in this break but it doesn't matter we achieved what we wanted now we have the three star conqueror status and now it's gonna be two times easier so we're just gonna go in and you're gonna get to see the difference between how much damage we were taking earlier and how much damage we're taking now so yeah so let's go ahead and go into this we're gonna do our best as we can to clump things together then we're just gonna hyper beam that direction and like I said guys it's, the first clear is always gonna be difficult so yeah just take your time you'll get it and once you get the three star conqueror status like I have right now see if you notice there the bomb didn't really do that much damage to me at all like see it could take a full hit if you saw earlier when I got hit by a bomb, I was literally losing half of my HP. Like I can literally stand here and take a lot more damage and punishment than I could before. Than I could do before. Sorry for that. But anyways, I'm gonna hyper beam that direction because I got some other things going down there. And we're gonna try to do some damage here. Bang 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 bang. Okay, see, we're taking so less damage now. It's like the conqueror status means everything in this game. Like if you want to make like things easier for you, and you're struggling to do your dailies. Yeah, this is the best way of doing it, guys. Like just invest that 200 rubies just to get that you know three three star conqueror status, and then you guys will be able to just farm this on a daily basis now. Now that you have your three star conqueror status, right? So yeah. So we're just gonna get our cooldowns here. Like everything doesn't like hurt me anymore, so I'm just not very afraid anymore like I was before. But you still wanna be weary of like getting hit by too many. Oh my gosh, I totally whiffed that. Getting hit by too many of those uh, bomb guys, you know what I mean? Anyways, we're gonna take care of him here. And you notice the last time we did on the last in our first uh, clear before we got our three star conqueror status. We've only did like, I don't know, maybe one fourth like his of his HP. So let's see how much more damage we can do to him now. Okay. So what I'm gonna try to do is try to group the go group them together. So hopefully he can like swing his sword this way. Perfect. I didn't mean to get hit by that, but I just did. But whatever. It is absolutely fine. So we're gonna try to do as much damage as we can here. Bang, 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 bang. Bang, 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 bang. And we did a little bit more damage definitely than before. So right here, this guy's gonna do an AoE. If you notice that, if you stay within the inner circle, you won't take that much, you won't take damage. If you're on the outer ring, you're gonna get hit. So you wanna stay near the boss, but you don't wanna get hit by this bomb that's coming in your direction. So he's gonna walk this way. And I ended up getting hit by it anyways. But we are taking some type of damage. That is for sure. Because we made a mistake there, walking into a bomb. So yeah. So we're gonna refresh our cooldowns here. And we're gonna prepare for the next burst that, that we're gonna do for him. Alright. He's gonna do that twice. He usually does that twice during his half HP, but he did it for this time. Bang, bang, bang. Let's try to do as much damage as we can. Bang, bang, bang. He is almost dead. Look at that. Look at that. I'm gonna stay inside. Perfect. We didn't get hit by anything. Dodge that. Dodge this bomb over here. 
gonna kill these little guys or not. <laughs> Epic fail there, that's for sure. We can definitely just kill him straight here, but I like to do the break. I'm gonna break here, and then we'll just finish him off. Ooh, I don't have my soul holding. Oh, okay, we're just gonna finish him off here. So you notice that level the difficulty is like totally different from our regular clear before we had our conqueror status but now we have our conqueror status damage is not as high and our damage overall is higher so it's absolutely okay if you want to use like your friend just to get your three star conqueror status and then now you're able to accomplish feral it's not the fastest but like i said this is just a display of a four star team just showing you guys that with a little bit of strategy, a little bit of setup, you can actually achieve it. So anyways, that's all there is to this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you guys have any more questions about Destiny 6, feel free to leave it a comment in the comment, this comment section. I do reply to everybody. But anyways, I'm going to be ending this video. I'll catch you guys later.